here's the trail I was walking up. It's a new trail they added on. It cost the taxpayers about eleven thousand dollars. There's the name. If they extended the trail from going over there all the way over to here. Not sure where all the money went because usually the trail the trail up there is got it's a paved walkway. This seems like a road but it says no vehicles. But there's a little bit of swamp. But swamp land. Swamp land. So you can see where the trail's going up through here. Big field up there, I bet you there's a lot of deer hanging out. Not sure if you can hunt in the town limits or not. But, uh, see, here's the problem. I was, when it first opened, I came out here to do some walking, right? Which a lot of people will be doing. And I came up through here and I, I thought, well, maybe the trail goes this way. Right? But it says authorized vehicles only and well, I'm not sure why I would say that, because down there it says no vehicles allowed. But after I seen that, I figured, well, you can't be going over there. That's the Coon Club. So I just stayed on the road, right? I figured, well, it goes this way. There's the, where they work on the town vehicles. So I kept walking up through here. And there's no signs nowhere. And uh, just stretch the old legs. I did come up here, shoot, maybe 15 years ago. Got my concealed weapons permit. But you can see up to here, that salt plant just over this hill right here. They make a lot of salt. So when you see a field like that and they make salt everywhere, got to be a lot of deer. There's a road going down through there. So there's no signs nowhere, right? I mean, if you see one, let me know. I should, shoot, I don't see one. So, up to here. And I'm just looking around, you know. Oh, well, this is pretty cool. There's a game gun range. I got a question for you though. If the police are going to use this as a gun range and a walking trail is right here, is that safe? But I videoed because there's two cars right here. One was a Saltwell Police Department, and one was a girl. And the girl got out of the pasture side and came over and uh, hit me. Stole my phone, and the cop just sat there and watched. Now, maybe. What would you say? Okay, a cop's hit up here in the, in the woods with a girl in his car and he's on duty. He told me he's on duty. The girl assaulted me. You could say she hit me and she hit me, right? Then she stole my phone and he watched the whole thing and did nothing. I mean, is that right? Are they allowed to do that? 
what this thing is. Just concrete wall. Huh. Ain't that something? But the, the cop, what got me is <laughs> she's doing all that. And the, the cop, saw so, well, cop, maybe this badge was 7, 17. Kept saying I'm not supposed to be up here, that I'm trespassing. How am I trespassing on public property? There's no signs. <laughs> Look here. They should probably practice a little more. Look at that spread. Look here. They're shooting at a cop. That don't make no sense. Why is a cop shooting at a cop? This guy must have turned somebody in. Another cop. He probably turned another cop in. So. Yeah, whatever, whatever you think, they do that. And for some reason, they're shooting at the, the back of a car. Why do they need to do that? This is the back of a Jeep. And they were practice shooting in through it. I mean, they going to shoot some man in the back of the head? Is that what they do that for? The point of this video is Sawdell, I tell you, used to be a, a very popular town, filled up every weekend. I mean, no more. That don't happen. It seems like people are afraid to hold the people accountable. Like on council two brothers are on council and then they hire their son to work for the town no conflict of interest there right but uh anyway i wanted to make this video because if you come out here and walk on the trail and you come up through here be careful because you might get you know, hit on and everything else, and a cop will be right there and watch it. He won't care. But, I mean, I did a little digging. I found out the girl that was in his car was his girlfriend. Why he's on the clock hiding in the woods. I mean, <laughs> it's crazy, right? But he sat there and watched her steal my stuff. Did nothing. She, I mean, matter of fact, she almost hit me when she was backing out. And he just sat there, hiding right over there in the in right over there in the woods. When it says no vehicles, if they want to say ex except for police, well, she's not police. You know, wants to trespass me, but there's a girl in his car, his girlfriend, and he don't trespass her. Ain't that, ain't that something? Well, I mean, I had to go to the police station to get my, my phone and stuff back, but that ain't the point of it. You shouldn't be hit like that just because you're out here filming on a trail. My goodness. I mean, where's arrows? Where's, where's an arrow? Where's, does that look, look like you could walk up through there? If you're not supposed to walk up through there, they should have some kind of sign. But no. I think this right here is what they spent $11,000 on. See? This little thing. It looks pretty expensive. I mean, if you... I did a FOIA request. They spent $11,000 on the new trail. It's got to be this, because there's no pavement that way. Or that way. 
that. Well, they did make this little sign up here with a lady's name on it. So together, yeah, it's probably eleven thousand dollars, I'd say. But uh, I wanted to put this out there that way everybody will know. Be careful when you go up through this trail. Because if there is an officer up here with his girl, they're liable to come down on you. You know, you got to keep that stuff hush hush. Can't be uh, walking up to here and catching them. They don't like that. You know? So, this is the new part of the trail that we spent all that money on. And, let's see. Today is Tuesday. Tuesday. What happened to me was less than a week ago. There's what they... Property of Saltville. No motorized vehicles. <laughs> well, they got that wrong, people. And if you see it, don't hang around. It could happen to you. So, just a note to everybody, okay? To show that there's no signs. Why was I attacked and my property stolen and a cop watch it? Well, I'm going to sign out for now. Y'all be good, hang in there, and vote for the right people. Later.